We begin tonight paying tribute to a beloved Kentuckian. EKU football legend Coach Roy Kidd passed away today at the age of 91. In his 39 years leading the Colonels, Coach Kidd won two national championships. There is no doubt his community and his university loved him. Daniel Miskell reports from Richmond. I'm really honored. It's a great loss. Skip Doherty has known Coach for 59 years. I came as a freshman in 1964. He was on his first football team. He just saw Coach two weeks ago, and it would be the last time he would see him. It really became real. You know, 1.36 this morning, you know, the, the dynasty uh, came to an end as far as with, with Coach Kidd. A dynasty of championships and prestigious awards. And on top of that, Doherty says Kidd coached about 1,300 football players and managed around 200 coaching staff throughout his career. Almost, almost 1,500 people that had a direct, he had a direct impact in. I played for Roy Kidd in high school. He was coach of Richmond Madison Model, 1956 through 1960. Many years later, Dr. Jim Coy now, became interested uh, in Kidd's early years I wrote a biography on him that is now archived both at EKU and the Madison County Historical Society. And some of the stories are remarkable. October the 11th, 1946 is a very important day in the life of Roy Kidd. They let this little 14-year-old freshman carry the ball in for the touchdown, won the game. Well, that little 14-year-old, Roy Lee Kidd, he became really like a brother. But I'm going to tell you, we always called him Coach. What I'm proud of most, I played for Coach Roy Kidd. And you'll see in the distance, Coach Roy Kidd's picture is up on the scoreboard screen. And EKU is going to leave it up for the rest of the week leading up to Saturday's game against Western Carolina University. There they will have a ceremony for Roy Kidd and his family members are expected to speak. So it's sure to be an emotional service here at this stadium, which is named after him. Reporting in Richmond, I'm Danielle Miskell, Fox 56 News. Condolences are pouring in from across the state following news of Coach Kidd's passing today. EKU football released a statement earlier saying, quote, It would be impossible to express everything Coach Kidd has meant to Eastern Kentucky University. He embodied the passion, purpose, and pride that our program strives for every day. Our program owes everything to his leadership and tireless work ethic. We are forever grateful that he was, is, and always will be a colonel. Governor Andy Bashir also honoring the EKU icon. He released a statement today saying, quote, Coach Kidd's awards will leave a lasting legacy, but he will also be remembered for his impact on the students he coached and supported. My prayers are with the Kidd family and all of EKU as we mourn this loss. And Coach Kidd's visitation will be this Sunday from 4 to 7 at the EKU Center for the Arts. Services will be there as well on Monday at 11, followed by a private burial at the Richmond Cemetery. In lieu of flowers, the family asks that donations be made to the Roy and Sue Kidd Endowed Scholarship at EKU.